You can find an Airbnb almost anywhere these days, mm -hmm. and there may be even some in your neighborhood, but not everybody seems to be on board with having short-term rentals in such close proximity. In fact, some cities and small communities are now taking steps to keep them out. Our Sion Roads is live in Bel Air tonight where there is a battle brewing over proposed restrictions there. Sion? Supporters say that this proposed ordinance is to try to keep Bel Air a city of homes, not hotels. But some other homeowners say it's an infringement on their rights. I have owned a home in Bel Air for 34 years and I've done Airbnb about seven years. Kathy Doty is what's known as a super host on Airbnb. If you look at my ratings on there, I'm always five star. With a private room and a guest house available on the rental site, she frequently hosts guests from all over the world. It's really been a tremendous experience. I have never had a circumstance or a situation. So when she learned the city of Bel Air was considering restricting short term rentals, I was shocked absolutely shocked and it's inappropriate to for the city to get involved. Two Bel Air City Council members are proposing an ordinance that would create a minimum six month term for rental or lease of single family homes with an exception for family members or previous and former owners. We consider Bel Air the city of homes and to have a hotel next to you is something that we don't think somebody should have to put up with. They're rude, they're disrespectful, it's awful. Homeowners on both sides of the issue speaking before city council last month. We're gonna limit the rights of every single homeowner in Bel Air. I think that having an ordinance that would um, Limit the short-term rentals would actually be beneficial for our community. Pranica owns two homes in Bel Air and leases one for long-term rentals only. When you have longer-term renters, um, they're not the type to just party, litter, and leave. So there's been no action taken on this proposal just yet. The mayor says he wants more research that includes closely examining neighboring West U's short-term rental ordinance that was in place since 2018. This could be back on the Bel Air City Council agenda by later this summer. Live in Bel Air, Sion Rhodes, KPRC 2 News.